you'll be able to actually have that little rotation stuff. There we have the apps for the iPhone logo now. Ah, <laughs> uh, no way. The sponsor of today's video is Dr. Phone by Wondershare. Dr. Phone allows you to have all sorts of different system repair and recovery tools all in one app for the Mac and the iPhone. Check it out in the link below. What is up my favorite people, Tech Labs here and welcome to 2018. Fresh year, fresh start, fresh new videos coming and today I wanted to start this year with the first new video that is about something that you will use and I will use. So this is about the jailbreak, let's say the partial jailbreak because there is now as you know two jailbreaks breaks the one that I shown you before to Pangu and the library OS or something like this but it's not working at this time so I don't really want to show it to you because you know uh, it's not about the wasting time it's about just this jailbreak that doesn't work but today we're gonna just talk about and I'm gonna show you some things that do work something like a jailbreak something that will allow you guys to customize your device on the iOS 11 up to iOS 11.1.2 on any 64-bit device and okay so the first question that you guys will ask is how the heck that I changed the icon shape on my home screen. That's very simple, it's thanks to this app. So let's go ahead and dive into it and let me show you guys first how you can download and then we're gonna just dive into this app and I'm gonna just do a review. So first of all, go ahead and go into the Safari browser like always and type in the apps for the iPhone.net. All of the links will be down below in the description for you guys so don't worry about that. Click on download app and now it's gonna be downloading on your home screen. Then go ahead and launch it. Uh, apps for the iPhone, very fast as always and now we're just gonna go ahead and go into the apps scroll down until you see the jailbreak apps click on this one and search for the turn gut turn gut yes and I, I tried searching you know for a translation for that word it's just a name it just does not translate to any language the turn gut it is just turn gut so treat it like a name okay so just click on this and now click on install so now it's gonna be installing on your home screen just like that all right so now goes the interesting part let's go ahead and launch the turn gut and I'm gonna show you guys how you can actually customize your device now without any jailbreak and you know it kind of uses the jailbreak kind of uses the exploit from the jailbreak and as you can see we can now just close the ad and click on run but before you're gonna do so just make sure you back up your device to your iCloud account or your computer because this actually uses some jailbreak stuff so I can just corrupt the system and you know you may lose all of your files that you have so make sure you just do a backup before doing so now let's go ahead and click on run and let's see if this will actually partially jailbreak our device and get this uh, read and write permission uh, with it so as you can see that's working that is so cool so there are so many options that you can configure in here so we have the change resolution block revokes uh, blocking updates control center icon mask and boot logo so now I currently using the boot logo and icon mask so the icon mask actually changes this uh, whole shape of your icons on your home screen so uh, this is uh, working 100% I've tested this one the boot logo as well so let's go ahead and dive into the few for example the boot logo so currently I'm using the apps for the iPhone boot logo and you can actually go ahead and test it on your device and then tweet it on Twitter to me that you have actually assigned this uh, little apps for the iPhone logo to your device so in order to actually install this uh, logo into your device as a boot logo just make sure you click on this little logo click on copy and then go back into the app and we're just gonna go ahead and paste this one in here so uh, just paste it like this and uh, change so if you, if you click on the change this will actually change this little logo and now dismiss we now need to actually go ahead and restart our device so click on exit to so make sure you do that so click on exit and now let's go ahead and restart our device all right so as you can see i'm starting the device and there we have the apps for the iphone logo now assigned as our boot logo on our device and guys it is just so so cool i mean the the level of functionality that this application brings to your iphone is just incredible you can actually make so much stuff on here if developer will add something more like a, not a boot logo but something uh, you know even the functionality like the live photographs and stuff like this he can actually do this because uh, this kind of read write permissions actually allow him to do so but as you can see this logo works and of course make sure you tweet at me on Twitter if you will assign it as your primary boot logo on your device but now let's go ahead and move on to the next okay stuff. so we were able to change the boot logo but how about the resolution so I've just googled the resolution of the iPhone 7 Plus and uh, let's go ahead and just try it on the regular iPhone 6 so changing the resolution so at the height this will be the 2208 and the width will be the 1242 okay so this is my keyboard so let's go ahead and change uh, confirmation changing the resolution because oh no this can actually you know f completely corrupt our iPhone and 
you know, this won't be able to actually boot into the system. But let's go ahead and just click on yes because, you know, guys, I can do everything for you. But success, that's cool. Let's go ahead and click on exit. And now we need to actually reboot the device once again. Ah, <laughs> uh, no way, no. Guys, check this out. Just look at this. Oh my gosh. I mean, if you compare this resolution to the iPhone 7 Plus, it's definitely not what we get on the iPhone 7 Plus. That's, that's a freaking iPad on the iPhone. No, <laughs> no freaking way. Just take a look at this. Let's go ahead and launch any app. Oh my gosh, look at this. Holy smokes. Holy smokes. Look at this, I have a full iPad now on my iPhone. That's so, so crazy. And you know what's more? So if you change the resolution on your iPhone 6 to the 6 Plus, for example, you'll be able to actually have that little rotation stuff on your iPhone going on. So it is so, so cool. This kind of feature is not possible. I mean, it is absolutely not possible on regular iPhone 6. So finally, guys, last thing that I want to try out on this iPhone is changing the icon shape once again, because, you know, I've changed it before, but I now want to show you guys how you can change it on your device. And now let's go ahead and go into the icon mask, uh, circular hexagon. So let's now maybe try the hexagon. So uh, change, uh, dismiss, uh, exit and now restart once again. Okay, so this is how it looks like the hexagon kind of uh, shape icons uh, Yeah, what did I expect from that? So for me guys, this is definitely not a way to go So yeah guys, I mean that should be pretty much it Just want to show you how you can actually customize your device in this simple way without any jailbreak and without a city And of course if you will be able to install the jailbreak in the future I mean you will be able to do that because it does not install any city. So there's nothing to remove Don't worry about that. And yeah guys, I mean that should be pretty much it Thank you so so much for watching as always if you enjoyed that video make sure you hit the like button also subscribe to the channel so you won't miss any future videos and as always guys i really hope to see you around on my next one and peace out